Hello, I'm Green. And I'm Purple. Welcome back to Green and Purple. This is the June special because not a whole lot happens in June. So we just, we're, 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 this is a new, uh, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Tradition. Tradition. We're going to do nostalgia specials in June. Yeah. Which is where we're going to pick a game from our childhood that we haven't played in a while and we're going to play it. So this one from our childhood is Zumbinis. And if you're thinking, hey, this game doesn't look like a game that's old enough to be from your childhood, well, they updated it with, like, new graphics and stuff. But it's pretty much Not the same really. game. I mean, um, maybe they did. I can't remember how it looked old. Yeah, it's definitely new. But uh, it's pretty much the same game, which I don't remember very well. So Caleb's going to be playing first. Yeah, so this is actually a versus episode right here. We are playing on hard difficulty, and um, this the point of this game is that it's a series of puzzles, mm -hmm. and you um, look at that face right there. Yeah, and no, basically you have to guide these guys, which are the Zumbinis, to safety. So this area right here is called the Allergic Cliffs, and I wrote notes down because I'm gonna. You're supposed to figure out the puzzles like what they are themselves, but I'm just gonna let everyone know. So so basically, how this one works is that these cliffs are allergic to. Um, one cliff is allergic to Zumbinis that don't have two features, and the other one's allergic to those that have either. So basically, the first round, I just have to kind of guess and check. So I see he's allergic. And if you see there, I lost a peg. I have five more tries before the bridge collapses. And then you just lose everybody? Yep. Okay, so... So the f that one in the back... If they don't have two features, he sneezes? Well, well, that's the thing. We don't know. Well, all I know is that one is allergic to some to the Zumbinis that don't have two features, and one's allergic to those that have either. Hmm. So you have to kind of figure that out. So I'm going to try and figure it out if it's hair. Nope. All right, so it's not hair. They don't really care about hair. So if they can't make it through on one, they have to make it through on the other one, right? Right. So let's see. So most of this, you guys, this is one you guys can play along with because it's a puzzle game. and So most of this will be just thought process, but we'll still, we'll be, still be talking. Let's see here. So let me see if it's eyes then. Well, they all have eyes, but like the same eyes, I'm guessing? Yeah, because they have different style of eyes. Like this one has shades, this one has... Nerdy glasses, this one. Yeah, okay, so let's see. That one? He seems to like those eyes. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I remember playing it as a kid. I never actually did much of the puzzles. Yeah. I just made Zumbinis a lot. Oh. <laughs> do, is that still in this? or? Yeah, you do that at, at the beginning, but we're doing practice mode, so it's not mm. really... Yeah, I just would get on and make a bunch of Zumbinis. I wouldn't do much with them. I Yeah, when I was younger and I, we went to the computer, in elementary school, mm -hmm. we went to the computer lab and that's when I played this. And I, I, I mean, this is what I always played because I loved it so much. I loved the puzzles. There was one that we're going to play that I would play all the time because it was like my favorite puzzle. And I remember all the kids were like amazed that I knew how to, I, I always knew how to figure it out. Um See, I would play either this or I would play uh, Mavis Beacon oh, teaches yeah. typing. Yeah. But I would just do the ones where that don't even require much typing, because <laughs> I wasn't very good at typing. But there was a few of them where it was just like, it wasn't even really related to typing. I think they were supposed to be mini games that you were like, hey, you did good at typing, so now you can play a mini game. But I would just play those <laughs> without doing any of the typing. Okay, I think I'm good. I mean, it's hard for you to fail at this point. Unless you just keep sending the same one. Yeah. It's like, why doesn't he want him? Which you can do. I mean, it's always possible to fail, I guess. Yep. Okay, so it was really the eyes. Yeah. That seemed to be his... His beef with them. them Good for you. There we go. And so for that round, I saved all 16. So now we're going to try this again with Austin playing... And, it's, and the thing with this is, um, to make it, it, this, is, I feel like this is fair because for the most part, uh, it, if you play it on practice mode, it randomizes what types of Zumbinis you get. I see. 
I hope you don't like that. Okay. So let's see. So you gotta go down here, buddy. There you go. And like I said before, this it does change up. So like for me, it was mainly the uh, the eyes that were they were allergic to. But for Austin, it can be something completely different. So the only thing that's different between this guy and that guy that I just went through is the wheels. So we'll see if he can make it through. Yep. All right. So we'll see if this guy likes uh, eyes, because this guy has the same eyes as both of them. And He's that's clear. the only that's the only thing that he has in common with them, which means he must be. All about them eyes. We'll let him th let her go. Through. That'd be funny if this was the thing that like was <laughs> in real life. Like if you saw somebody with a certain hairstyle, you just you just sneezed uncontrollably. <laughs> it's like I'm allergic to that bowl, bowl cuts. <laughs> okay, you don't like this guy. It's Gazuntite. So we'll send you up here. I know it's not his hair because he wouldn't let either of these guys through. So, I'm going to go off of, can it be nose? Yeah, nose is, because nose colors. Okay, so we'll try and send this guy. The, there are four components to Zumbinis. Their hair, their eyes, their nose color, and their type of feet they have. Okay. I'll try and send this person. Alright, so he's okay with red noses as it appears. We'll let this guy go through too. Then he spills back this guy. No? No, no. Doing okay. Alright, so. Do they do that whenever you got in like half of them or something? Okay, so it's not just red noses. So we'll have to see what they all have in common. Yeah, because that Zumbini right there had a red nose. That's true. So I don't think it's noses. Well, the, everything else is different about them. Let's see. Because they all have different eyes. Wait, that's right, because it's two features, not just one. Okay, so he wants two things? So it's like, he's. I bet he's okay with these guys that have red noses because they have something else that doesn't make him allergic to them. Okay. We'll try and send... Because now we're out of red noses. We'll try her. He's okay. fine. He's fine with that. Maybe it's the shoes. We'll try send him with the shoes. Nope. nope. <laughs> Not quite. Get down here. Why are you walking over there? Acting all loner and whatnot. And he doesn't want her either. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh man. Oh gosh. Okay, so this person's pretty similar. We'll try and see if he wants her too. Nope. Yeah, he's cool. He's cool with her. She's really similar too, except she has a blue nose. So we'll see if he's cool with her. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> part of me wants to help Austin, but another part like it's that, it's that yeah, we're balance not balance between cooperation and competition. Yeah. Hmm. So let's see. Which one do you look more like? I'll see if you want to go here. Nope, he doesn't like you. So one more and I'm dead, or one more, like one more before? One life? more, this is your last chance. Okay. Next, The next sneeze will collapse the bridge. I see. Okay. See if you want him. Nope. nope. Oh. 14 out of 16, I'll take it. Okay, I'll write that down. That wasn't that. That was good. That was, that was good. Fourteen. Yeah. Okay. And now it's gonna go back to me, and we're gonna go on to the next puzzle, which I have written down as the Stone Cold Caves, which is this one right here. Here we go. I remember these guys. We've got visitors. Do we let them in? They remind me of the trolls from Frozen. Yeah. The little rock yeah. trolls. <laughs> Frozen real, stole it from Zupinis. Real fixer upper. Mm-hmm. Okay, so how this one works on this difficulty, one small rock doesn't like two features, and one large rock doesn't like a certain feature. Or it can work the other way around. One large rock could not like two features, and one small rock could not like a certain feature. So really, once again, you just gotta test the waters. Certainly. Okay. So... 
This is all about them not liking something, or does some one of them like something? It's all about them not liking something. Okay. Yeah. So you go up to. Because she's the same except for her propeller. So she either likes the nose, the eyes, the hair, or the hair. Because doesn't the hat count as part of their hair? Okay. Something about him he doesn't... She doesn't like. Hmm. How many tries do you get? I don't know, but I know that if you... I forgot how... You can't really tell on this one. Nope, sorry. The only way... I, yeah, there's no way to tell on this one, but once you run out of turns, the uh, caves collapse. Mm, killing all of the Zumbinis inside. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, Krug, which one did I just send up? Uh, that, the, the, the one back there. Oh, yeah. This one. Yeah. Get out from over Okay, so let's see. There's something about you she didn't like. So if that's she true, if I, his nose. if I if he can't go here, that means that this guy can't also go here because he has okay. so he has to go either here or here. Well, it wasn't his nose or his feet because he let both of he let her through. So and, oh, let's try that. Nope. So now there's only one more option for him. Yep. I see. I'm starting to understand. Be quite honest, I never fully understood the one before this. I just kept trying to, and I was like, alright, <laughs> ended up doing pretty good. <laughs> Let's see here. There's a thunderstorm going on outside, so if you hear rumbling, that's why. Or my stomach. <laughs> so let me see here. What was it? Because it works at one small rock, doesn't like two features. So it it's not the feet, and it wasn't the nose. So it's either his eyes or his hair. Right. Because... Yeah, it was In other words, I wouldn't send that guy because he has both his eyes and his hair. We'll see if he lets him through. Alright. Okay. Nope, he's not cool with it. Away <laughs> you go. What a bunch of jerks. I know they well these they, rocks are jerks. Well they are stone cold. Get it? Dun, dun, dun. Sorry. No. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Have a good time. Okay. So for this, it was the feet. It has to be... No, wait, the nose, though. Let's that try... Nose, though. Someone else with a blue nose, though. Let's <laughs> try you going here. So he's cool with it. You go in. Okay. So it wasn't the nose. It was the... It had to have been the feet, then. It had to have been the feet. That the top one wasn't cool with? Yeah. I have to try and... Right, like... because, look, these all have roller skates. She was cool with these guys, but she didn't like this one right here because his feet were different. It has it has to be the feet. Mm -hmm. So let's see here. We still have to worry about the bottom guys, what they want. Right. So the, the big rocks don't like two things or one thing? Well, it says one. It says one small rock doesn't like two features. Or, and one large rock doesn't like a certain feature, okay, but it could also go the other way around. Oh, okay. We I don't understand. know. We have to. That's part of it. Yeah, you have to figure out. Let's try you. All right. <laughs> Oops, not you. Try going over here. All right. I must be careful about who I let in. He's racist. I know that. That was totally racist. Yeah. This is all. This is all like a. Uh, a, sort of a I don't know what I'm looking the word for, but it's all about immigration, right here. Yeah, I, yeah. Because the <laughs> Zumbinis, I forgot who, but someone they're invaded, like exiles. Yeah, someone invaded their land and kicked them out, and so they're running off to find a new <laughs> place this to call home. It's all a commentary on immigration. It all makes sense now. Zumbinis was so much nope. deeper than we thought. What goes up must go down. Yeah, I, uh, the artwork style is definitely the same from before, be but it the, it looks like they redid some of the animation. Animation, well, and just made it look cleaner. Oh, because okay. It, the game's from like the '90s. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Which mean, I mean, back then computer resolutions weren't nearly as high as they are now. Oh, if you're wondering, yeah, I this I found this on Steam. Did they just? Yeah, I don't remember. Maybe they just like put it back on Steam. That's gone. Right? right, my that's my bad. I know. Why? That was my fault. Yeah, he he doesn't like the rollerblades. My bad. He just eats her. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. You would probably go here. Nope. <laughs> the path is closed. 
Closed. So you probably don't like his nose. Oops. And so I'm gonna put you here. Thing whenever you're playing it, since this is like an early yeah. childhood game, mm -hmm. is whenever you're playing it on like the easiest difficulty, it's pretty hard to actually fail anything. It's basically you just keep trying until you get it. Because, you know, if you have a six or seven year old trying to play this game, they're not going to be able to figure out like, oh, well this person doesn't like two things and he doesn't like one thing. Right. Like most six and seven year olds don't have that kind of like logical functionings. Will she make it? Yeah, because she likes propellers. The springs. So far, this is all I got. Don't be shy. Yeah. No, calm down. <laughs> Wait, nope. that's not what. It was. Can't let you in. Yeah, because I think it's her. Maybe her eyes. eyes. Yeah, it's the eyes. Well, it might be her nose. I had a feeling. Wrong way. Right, right, right. Because the, the no one no one with springs has been allowed up here. Have a good time. She's all by herself in that cave. So let's see. You have a yellow nose. Probably. The I know. Lower. I know. I know. This one can't go up. It has to go one of the lower paths. I mean, unless it's something about his eyes, which haven't been let in either way. But I would say probably that path right there. No, well, you know, what do I know? <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm hoping it's this one. Yep, okay. And then what feet do you have? So you have to go either here or here. Let's see here. I mean, the only place with people with those feet right now are on the right. Correct. But that, that doesn't say a whole lot. I'm gonna She's try the this only one. one with those eyes. Yeah. In the entire game. Because look, the the ones on the left all have these um, baseball cap hats. Mm -hmm. So I had a feeling that this guy doesn't like those. Mm -hmm. So I think if I put her here, he wouldn't let her through. I see. So there we go. So Did now it. we're gonna do this again. Now with Austin. Let's roll. Here they come. <laughs> Damn refugees! <laughs> no, I want you to go try to go through there. Yeah. Nope, he doesn't like it. Well, one of the things that you have to do on most of these early puzzles, it's a guess and check. Because <coughs> you have nothing really to go off of. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're cool with her. <coughs> what about... How about... Hmm, how about this guy? Okay, by me. Welcome. Cool. So, so far we got that they like the shoes. Okay, by me. Something about her he doesn't like. <laughs> okay, so you, you're cool with it, so I'll let you up there. And then you're pretty similar, so we'll see if he'll let you back. Okay, by me. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, <coughs> let's see here. Maybe you want to go up here? Nope. Not I think when one of them hits it, you still don't know what they think. Right. Okay, so we'll try here first. Go on. Have a good time. Cool. I think it's the feet. Yeah, it seems like the feet. These guys are feet cyst. <laughs> here, why don't you try going up here? Okay, he's so cool. he's cool with it. She's, She's cool. cool with it. Okay. These guys are pretty similar. So we'll see if he can go through. No, no. he doesn't like it. So which means he has to go through here. Go. Okay, I'm gonna try. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you're right. If you can get to the uh, two gray stone guys, then you pretty much have. Yeah, it. you pretty much know. It's like, well, if, yeah, you pretty much have it. Okay, so he doesn't like those feet, I don't think, because he's the exact same as him besides his feet. Which means, we'll try here. Okay. So. He doesn't like people with those feet, which means you have to be over here somewhere. Mm, okay. <laughs> okay, so you have to be down here. Fair okay, enough. You go. If you're gonna be racist, at least be consistent. Okay, by me. Okay. Where do you go? Let's see. So all of them right now have been with those kind of shoes have been over here. Question is, which side? Which up top or down bottom? Okay. 
So, everyone down here has hats, which means I got, well, we don't have any more hats anyways. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I haven't had this hair anywhere, but all of the one, nope, his eyes have gone either way. His feet are definitely means he's on this side, most likely. Yeah. I'm going to try this one because of his nose color. No, he doesn't like him. So we'll send him here. Wrong way. I would think it's the, uh, probably the, Maybe the hair. hair. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Problem is, like, we don't have any of these guys here of any in any of them. So this guy, then it's probably gonna go up here. No, so he's got to go on this side probably. That's what I'm thinking right here. I think you gotta go right here. Well, again, I think I already I think I already said this, but uh, the fun thing about us because this is our real big puzzle game that we're playing. Mm -hmm. So the funny. The fun thing about it is, like, if you're watching at home, then you probably already have this all figured out. <laughs> if, if you took the time to actually. Maybe oh, well, then you guys have the advantage, because you can just pause the video and figure it out. Cheaters? Let's see here. Okay, I'm just kidding. Okay, so you let him through, through. So he... It was him that wasn't cool with it, so maybe it's the hair. So we'll let him... Nope, he doesn't like it. Okay. So let's see. Let's try going this way. I think he'll let him. Up. I like how the side rocks are the older ones, and then the the gray ones are the younger, mm -hmm. well, adult ones. No, if you don't like it. you, punk. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I don't know exactly how many times you have to miss this one, but I think it's pretty lenient. Okay. Because I think you'll see rocks falling when it warns you that you have like one more left. Mm. Certainly. Sweet. There we go. Job. Calm Thanks. Down. Calm down there, man. All right, where are we going next? Next up is Pizza Pass. Pizza Planet? <laughs> I love Pizza now, Planet. Now, this one is pretty hard on this difficulty. Pizza for lunch and snack and dinner and dessert. Baby would satisfy me. That didn't seem like it had the right inflection at all. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we have three uh, trolls here. Arno, um, their names are Arno, Will, Willowmean, and Shyler. Mm. That's Shyler, Willowmean. Oh wait, I don't think you guys have seen the mouse. The, yeah, the. Okay. No, I think I turned it off to where the the mouse they can't see it. Mm. Um, the brown. Never mind. You guys figured out. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Okay, so how this um, mini game, how this puzzle works, is that. The each one of these guys want a certain type of pizza with a certain type of ice cream, and you have to figure out what they like, and they'll let you know. So, to start off, I'll just do this and this. Who wants it? That topping, not for me, thanks. What a punk. Whoa, really? He wanted it. That was his one. Okay, so... You so only have to get one of them for each. Yeah, so notice how they, um, Arnold and Wilma, Wilma, Willow Mean said that they, they were like, ill yuck, which means that they both either didn't like the pineapples or the, um, topping on the ice cream. Well, the short fat one, he just said, ooh, yuck, but she said not the topping. Yeah, but the topping can mean anything. Because mm. I put two toppings. I put the top, this, and the pineapple. Oh, I see. I, I thought it was just ice cream. Yeah, no, you have two different toppings for the ice cream. Oh, I see. So now, since I know there's something about it, I'm not going to include the pineapple this time. I'm just going to do peppers and... Wait, I'm going to take that off. Just peppers. Oh, so you can do no toppings too? Yeah. Sometimes that's, a, that's what they want. Mm. Not for me, thanks. Okay, so Arnold, he likes that, but he wants more toppings. So he likes the peppers. Willow, Willow, um, Willow does not like the peppers. So. so what do you do for him? Well, I have to figure out what more he wants. Oh, you can put more than one thing on. Okay, I see. I understand now. What a pig. 
Something's wrong. <laughs> okay, so, so far I'm still good with Arnold. He still likes what I'm giving him. So let's see if he wants mushrooms on top of that, too. Nice. That's it. Okay, he no, does not, not it. He doesn't like mushrooms. That topping? No. Man, she just tossed it. Okay, and if you notice, like, Arnold, he put the ones he liked over here on his stump, and they both didn't like any of it, so it just went down here. Oh, I see. Maybe the cheese? I mean, let's be honest, none of them have had cheese on them yet. True. They're not really pizza. Something on that I don't like. He does not like cheese. <laughs> what a punk. <laughs> okay, so he wants something on his ice cream. It has to be that. Because I remember when I put the topping on for him, for uh, Shiler, mm -hmm. he said, ew, yuck. So I don't I think he, he likes that. But he could have also have said it towards the pineapples. Yeah. So oh, we'll okay. see. See what he wants. There. That's what he wanted. These people are weird. <laughs> Now we just need to figure out what Will, uh, Willow here wants. Yeah, we don't know anything about like what she likes. We just but know we what she kn doesn't like. I know she doesn't like pineapples. She possibly doesn't like the ice cream topping, and she doesn't like the peppers. So let's see if you like pepperoni. Pepperoni and tomato sauce. <laughs> That's an interesting pizza. That topping, no. Man, okay, you are just like picky. She would not do well at a CC's. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I want. Pizza with just tomato sauce and nothing else on it. <laughs> there we you go. Like those mushrooms? I'd appreciate more toppings. She likes the mushrooms. It's probably mushrooms and cheese, maybe. So stuck up. <laughs> mushrooms are gross, by the way, so she's wrong about life. Yeah, and no, I, I don't like mushrooms. <laughs> mm, pizza makers. I think that's it. Yeah, did it. Nice. Look at him on the left. Arnold, yeah. yeah. He's, yeah, the, oh my goodness. She just looked like she ate a zoomie. <laughs> <laughs> blood everywhere. All right, now it's your turn. And once again, this is all randomized, so they want something completely different this time. All right, let's go here. All right, let's try. Peppers. Sure. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure because this is a common puzzle, and it's really like there are multiple ways to a, approach it. So he doesn't like one of those things. She doesn't like something on there either. <laughs> they just, oh man. I like how they're so like ambiguous about it. It's like, oh man, something on that like I if, don't like. If you want a pizza, then you need to tell me what you want on it, right? <laughs> I'll try that. Yeah, let's see if it was the topping or if it's the peppers. Let's see. Something must go. So it must be the peppers for Not him. Topping. No. She doesn't like the peppers either. Oh, something's wrong. So uh, there's a chance it's the peppers. Nobody here likes uh, those peppers. Alright, so we'll try pepperoni. Plain ice cream. Yeah, see, plain is a good way to go because. Okay, but he didn't like either of those toppings on it, right? Oh, well, that's wrong. the thing. We don't really know. We don't know if it was just the peppers that they didn't like. Mm -hmm. But he likes what you're giving him so far. Okay, so we'll try that. And mushrooms. Okay. Well, yeah, how about that? But yeah, plain is a good way to go because, uh,. That they they can't not like plain. That topping, no. Okay, I get it. Something's wrong. You shut up. <laughs> uh oh. Uh -uh. I don't like it. How about uh, cheese? That's like if you, once again using CCs. It's like if you went to a CCs and you're just like, and they're like, what what would you like? And you're just like. I want a pizza. And like, what kind of pizza? I don't know. Just bring me something. And they bring you like a pepperoni with cheese. And you're just like, something on that I don't like. Oh, they're right. And they're like, 
So what do you want? Not this. <laughs> <laughs> Not what? Something on here. There. <laughs> you figure it out. Okay, so we need... Let's try pepperoni and... and pineapple. pineapple. I'm not a fan of the uh, pineapple on my pizza. I'm not a fan of pineapple in general. More stuff. Okay, so he likes pineapple and pepperoni. So he probably wants the topping on his ice cream. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. The question is, which one? Man, he's just hoarding those pizzas. I know, right? <laughs> okay, so let's try that. You want it? How about that? Okay. He so doesn't we'll... like sprinkles. Okay, we'll try the the cherry, and if he doesn't like that, then it must be pepperoni, pe pineapple, and jalapeno and peppers. No, he doesn't like peppers. Well, he might. Right, Both time we right. tried peppers, he, we had ice cream toppings too. Oh, that's oh no, that's not good. Hmm. The next one you bring, if it doesn't satisfy someone's taste, they're gonna knock. I see. They're gonna, you're just not gonna start losing people. All right. They do that whenever. I see. How about that? Okay, so it has to be the peppers. Yeah. There's something there I hate. Uh oh, there's something on that I don't want. <laughs> Siler is my favorite. There's something on that I don't like. I don't want. I don't like any of them. Oh, he just went to oblivion. Yep. Team Rockets blast me off again. And then he just wants plain ice cream. There you go. You have a very specific taste, man. More. What? Something's wrong. More. Uh-oh. Ow. He didn't like either of these. He didn't like cheese or mushrooms. Wait, what all was on that last one? Peppers, pine or pineapple and pepperoni. And peppers, right? Yeah. And Oh, mushrooms. You've got the mushrooms. Oh, does he like mushrooms? Cuz he put Oh, wait. Yeah, because look, right there. Oh, you're right. So he wanted everything except for cheese. Yep. That looks gross, man. It's all... It's all right. Okay, now you gotta figure out what Will Willow and Shy Shyler want. Okay, I'll just send a... Let me try that. It's exactly what I want! <laughs> Okay, so she doesn't even like cherries. Thank you. Oh, that's what Shyler wanted. That's what he wanted! <laughs> <laughs> These people are crazy! <laughs> and she didn't... I don't think... I just wanted a plain pizza with just the tomato sauce. <laughs> and a cherry... And, 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 and whipped cream on my, on my ice cream. That's what she wanted! What? These guys are crazy! <laughs> <laughs> what even is it? Right. They wanted tomato pizzas! I lost two zumbinis. Okay. That's awesome. You <laughs> guys are crazy. We were joking about it. I just want a pizza with just tomato sauce. But that's what both of them wanted. <laughs> oh, oh god. And um, sometimes you'll get one where they just want everything plain. They don't want any toppings at all. <laughs> what a bunch of weirdos. Okay, so our next mini-game, our next puzzle we're doing is Fleens. Fleens? Yeah. Oh, these are like hard rock zoom beanies. Yeah, pretty much. This was the puzzle that I played all the time. I love this one. So basically, what's going on here on this difficulty is that um, one feature goes with another. So basically, um, let's say, so see how there are three ones that have pink hair? That mm -hmm. is done in a mohawk? That means that, let's see... It has to correspond with something else. So their hair does not correspond with their hair. It so it has to be with their eyes, their nose, or their feet. Yeah. Which, if you're playing this on easier difficulty, then the, everything does correspond with them. Oh, which makes it easier, but this is more difficult. So I know there's three of these guys, so I'm going to try and look for... Oh, and what you're trying to do, see these three fleens on this bee br branch on this beehive? Mm -hmm. You're trying to get these three to jump off. Oh, I see. Let's see. So I'm, I'm going to look for Zumbinis that oh, there's only three of something besides their hair. There's th uh, no, there's four propellers. I see eyes. No, not eyes. Um, 
There's three guys with the dotty eyes. Yeah, three guys with dotty eyes. Okay, and I think... Their eyes are the same. It's the only thing that's similar about them. Can well, you... except for maybe their nose. I can't see one of them. The good nose. thing is I can move these guys. I can adjust these guys. So let me see here. If those hair do correspond with those eyes, something here... The problem is, is that... Their eyes are similar, though, but there's nothing... Is there three of something else? Hmm. Three... One propeller, two propeller... No. I think there's like oh, four springs! Propeller. The springs! There's three springs. And two of them have the same hair. Yeah, okay, so... This... The pink mohawk corresponds with the springs. There, let's see here. I don't understand how we're how you match them up. The hairs, these two hairs, go with the fleens that have um, eyeliners. The so let's see. So that oh, if that's the case, that means that this one. It has to be this one. Yep. Oh, we're just doing those three. Okay, so these ones are just there for reference. Yeah. Okay, I see now. Okay, so I figured that out. So... So this lady has a helmet on, and there's five people with helmets on. Two, three, four... Five. Five, yeah, so let's see. And we know now, I know now for a fact, that the hair corresponds with the feet. So, I need to find five people that have similar feet. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so there's five propellers, so I'm assuming it's the propellers, because there's not five of anything else. So, I have that down. So next up is that the eyes went with the uh, hair. I thought. The hair, yeah. So that means that the... So we need somebody with the... Uh... There's four people with that. those eyes. Hold on. Yeah, this one's this one's thinking. Cause the the hair went with the feet. The eyes went with the hair. That hair with the pink mohawk. Hmm. So wait, the feet. Kill. Yep. Deal. What? Or no deal. No, that's not what we're <laughs> playing. Hold on. Once again, you got. Wait, there's three of the. I miss Deal or No Deal. It was a, one of the few good game shows. Okay, so it's one of it's one of these three, and two of them have similar of something else because it's uh, same nose. No, their noses are all different. No, I'm, I'm bad with colors. <laughs> so it's these two. Because they have similar shades, and then now all I need to figure out is which nose. So it's one of these two, and I really can't. I have to just guess. Okay, so it's the other one. So you don't want to get the other ones? No. No, I see. So it's this one. Yep. Okay. So now I know for a fact. We just need to get this one here. Now I know that this face mask corresponds with the hair, so I need somebody with a little scruffy hair. So it has to be this only one, two of them, I think. this one, this oh, one, three. or this one. No, there's one more. He's behind the the lady. Which one? He's right behind her. Oh, thanks. Okay, so these five here. Now we know for a fact. These two had red noses, and that one with the glasses. So, well, we don't have to worry about that, though. We need the bandana. The eyes went with the... Pro... Green nose. The hair is with the eyes. The hair is with the eyes. So we got that down. I need the faces that go with the noses. 
So we know that these represent red. That represents blue. So it can't be a cyclops. Stupid cyclops. So it's one of these four. And we don't know what feet... Um, the feet go with the nose color. So blue goes with that. The treads go with green. So it can't be a green nose. It can't be a blue nose. So it has to either be a pink or red nose. But we also know... Well, let's see. We also know... It's the, it's the left guy. That's, that's my two cents. Now, Caleb. Yep. The banker has offered you $250,000 for that Zumbini. Got him. See, I told you. So it is. Did it. I love that puzzle. I love that puzzle. That's my favorite. I'm not smart enough for any of these puzzles. <laughs> it's, all right. If throughout this entire thing you're like, I don't understand how Caleb's getting any of this, then you're like me. Uh, okay, let's see. So we got four with the pink hair. We got one, two, three, four, five with green hair. Four with the, the Viking, Viking helmet. <laughs> okay, so let's look for five people. And only one with the blue thing Four, hair five, six okay what the, what is there six of one two three no not the one two three no all right let's see here we need one two maybe shoes buckle no. my shoes three four shut the door mm, maybe news oh gosh not the nose color Oh, if you guys are wondering, is there any music in this game? No. No, nah, it's just random sound effects. Because <laughs> remember, this was an old, this was like an old 19, um, 1900s, uh, 1990s, 1990s, <laughs> uh, computer game, so, you know. I mean, technically, you're not wrong by saying 1900s. Yeah, see? <laughs> but the 1900s is a long Whoa! span of time. It's just teleported. It's like, nah. I don't feel like going over there. I'm going to be here. Get over there. Okay, so I need six. Or one, two, three, four. Yeah, six of something. And I'm not seeing six of anything yet. Hmm. Maybe the, maybe this here? No. No, there's only five of that. Hmm. Not the... Uh, I don't see five of, or six of any of the eyes. Maybe nose. One, two. No, I don't think it's the nose. Maybe feet. I don't see six of anything in particular. I mean, nothing's jumping out to me. Hmm. Oh, that's so hard. What? Cause I, I want to help you, but... Hey, I've been helping you. You can help me a little bit. Okay. Hmm. You want my help? I'm looking. Okay. Let's see. I feel like this shouldn't even be a versus. Yeah, we've just kind of been cooperating with each other. I mean, from here on out, if you, if you, if the person <laughs> needs help, they have to ask for it. Okay. And if the other person helps the other person, then that's their fault. <laughs> hmm. And you only get to ask me for help for, like, two times. So we only get to ask each other for help two, two times. Okay. Hmm. You guys figure it out there? If you have, put it in the comments. Don't, don't lie. I don't think anyone's figured it out. Uh, uh, was, hmm. I totally like I said before, these this one is easier on the lower difficulties because the hair does correspond to the hair. The mm -hmm. eyes do correspond to the eyes. and You just have to figure out... How many of each of them are pretty? Yeah, much? I mean, in that case, it's it's very simple to figure out which one goes with which because, you know, you just gotta pair up which goes with which. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. No. 
Another reason why I like the fact that I'm practiced that randomizes everything is because when you actually play through this game on story mode, you can make a bunch of Zubinis have very similar qualities, and that makes a lot of the puzzles very simple because... There's only one difference between one Zubini yeah. and another one. You can make it so that there's minimal, minimal difference between your Zubinis. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can kind of help yourself out. But that's not fun. Or maybe it is, because, you know, most people that would play this are probably... <laughs> most people that elementary this are school level. much younger than we are. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm not seeing six of anything. I guess I'm just not observant enough. Hmm. But I'll keep looking. I'll never stop looking. Okay. I'm here. I forget what, what there was six of to begin with. Oh, wait. The hat, the baseball. 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 I've turned into Porky Pig. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. Is there another one? Six? One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay, so it's noses. So those hats, I think, correspond to those noses. So it has to be one of these for her. So eyes. Let's see how many of these. There's one, two, three. It's only th oh four. Am I missing one? Four. So we need some that's only four of them have. Mm-hmm. It's not shoes. Not her. Is it? Could be springs because we only have four springs. So let's just assume that it is springs. So we'll say that it's one of these three. Okay. So now the hat. Now there's one, two, three, four. With that hat. Uh huh. So we need one of these three. Where the th so it's either have to be their nose or their eyes. So let's see how many we got. Nose. We have one. Two, three, four. four, five. Oh. So it's not the red nose. So we have a yellow nose and a green nose. Um. Oh well, it still could be her because it could be eyes. No, come, <laughs> back. come back here. Uh. So let's see. The yellow nose. One. Is that the only yellow nose? Two. Three. Three yellow nose. Green nose. One. Two. Three. I think just three. So let's go with eyes. So we're looking for four. Look into my eyes. One, two. Three. Look at me with your special eyes. My Look at me. Brand. Does anybody remember that commercial? Me. I remember it. No, but it was him. These are bullies, though. It's like they only pick on one specific type of person. Yeah. It's like dealing with your doppelganger here. Okay, so I was right about the nose being with the that hat. So we're still dealing with these hat people. <laughs> hat people. Hat people. Uh, the worst. Ugh. Literally the worst. Okay. See that guy with the baseball cap? Ugh. Hat pe Those hat people are the worst kind of hat people. Okay, so this person has the same has the eyes and the nose that I want. But his hair and his shoes are different. So this person is different from the one I want in two ways. This fleen's giving me mixed vibes here. No, is he not. trying to be a punk rocker or just a, se a sexy lady? Maybe it's a sexy lady with a punk rock hair. Yeah, it could be that. With a bandana. <laughs> with a cowboy hat. Or he could be a football playing pirate in space. In space. <laughs> Let's see. There's one, two, three, four. People with... with uh... eh, we'll try you. <laughs> I make a lot of weird Yay. noises. <laughs> they sound like Doodle Bob. <laughs> Doodle Bob. Me hoi me noi. I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch that. Me how? Me how, Obama? Okay, so the hat corresponds to eyes, and the nose corresponds to 
What else do they have in common? The, the nose, maybe? No, the hat's the nose. Which means the nose must be the eyes. Eyes. And then the hair is either the feet, or is it has to be the feet. Or the... Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, we want someone with red shoes. So it has to be similar to this guy in some way. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try one more. No, let me think here. Because I don't want him to. This guy. Hmm. Let me think. So we have. Excuse me. That wasn't, that wasn't a real that fart. It wasn't a real fart. It was a mouth fart. <laughs> If it was a real fart, you probably wouldn't be able to hear it on the, the the mic. Unless it was really loud. Yeah, if it was really concussive. All right. I'm going to try one more spring guy real quick. Language. Jeez, I mean, come on. There are, like, children here. Why are we making so many Spongebob? I'm making so many Spongebob references. <laughs> oh, wait, why did I do another guy with the hair? Whatever. How many can I get over here before like? Stuff I think come? after the f the f once there's five, I think there can only be four in the branch at a time. I see. Okay. So the springs. Springs are definitely the hair. So feet is hair. Or no, hair is nose. Right, I gotta remember that. Hair is nose. Hair is nose. Green hat, so it's not gonna be a green hat. And it's not gonna be one of the pink haired ones. Because pink hair. Don't go with that. Call it a pink hawk. <laughs> How about. Let me see here. If you haven't deduced already, I'm not good at this. <laughs> Let's see. You're fine. I won't admit, this is it's a it's a hard puzzle. Don't give me your patronizing bull crap. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> Wow <laughs> Okay, let's see what we have. Like it's a lot to think through and it's easy to get mixed up because you can say like, Oh, the Zumbini's hair matches with the Fleen's nose, but the Fleen's hair matches up with the Zumbini's eyes, and that's when it gets, like, confusing, and mm -hmm. you get stuff mixed up. <laughs> okay, so... Maybe the Fleen's are just in love with these. It's, that could be it. Okay, sorry. Five. You, you, five. You can get five on a branch. I see. So, we have... I thought it was five. I had a feeling. No, I didn't. I said four, but you know, I had a feeling it was five. <laughs> so it has to be someone. I was like, "There's no way it would be four. That's too low." With this hair or this hair. Car. Which means it has to be one of these five. Now, let me see him. Hmm. <laughs> This guy is nothing like this lady. There's no similar qualities at all. Crick, crick. So we want someone that's not like him, so it can't be her. Aww. And it can't be him. Aww. It has to be one of these two people. And if hair corresponds to nose, we have anyone with a blue, pink, or red, so red. The first two. Is there anything about these that's similar to what I want? This guy. I'm gonna go with this person. No. Nope. Now my zumbinis will be eaten. Oh, six. <laughs> Seven. Eight. <laughs> there you go. But now that one's gonna fall off. Oh, well. <laughs> They're friends now. Oh, I guess he just ran off. Okay. That fleen's gonna. No, they, they, it always says, like, if you lose in beanies, they just go back to the last checkpoint so that no <laughs> one dies here. Okay, so. It has to have two similar qualities to this guy. 
Let's see. These have two similar. No. What about this lady? She has two similar things. Yeah, I'm playing playing by the seat of my pants. Yeah, there, there we go. go. So they only lost one. Yeah. Two. Well, two. Two? Oh yeah, that's right. Man, this guy doesn't care about the Zumbini's lives. He's like, whatever. Progress. <laughs> well, because this one um, is going on so long, I'm going to just make us play one more. Oh, is this going to be the the catch-all? Yeah. So this will be our... You know, it's five, so it's still a nice number. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do Lion's... What's it called? Lion's Lair. Not Lion's Den, you know. Like <laughs> Lion's Living. Oh, wait. <laughs> Bless you. Okay, now, this puzzle is actually pretty tricky how it works tricky, is that tricky. what oh my how it works is that you have to put the zubinis in a certain order here and this tablet that the that's in front of the line here is telling you how you're supposed to place them the upper layer is telling you what the groups are while the lower layer is telling you the subgroups but see it's not all the way filled out so you have to kind of take into account of what exactly um you gotta guess and check once more so, like, for example, I don't know what the first group is. I know the first subgroup is red, though. So, but we need to go by groups first. I don't know what the first group is, but I know the second group is any Zubini with... What is that? Oh, any Zubini with the um, low-leveled eyes. So that's the second group. So now I just need to figure out... What is red? Red nose? Yeah, red is... Red corresponds to their noses. So right now, all I need to pay attention to is their eyes and their noses. Their hair and their feet play no... Um, they don't They don't play into this puzzle. So let's see here. It looks like Cy Cyclops are the fourth group or whatever. Yeah. So now, so obviously the thing we have to figure out now is what's the first, third, and fifth group. But I know that red is the first subgroup, so... Oh, let's see, not you. Excuse me. Green is the second subgroup. So I'm just gonna put you... Let's see, two. Put you up here. Okay. Alright. Oh, okay, so it'll knock you off immediately if it's not the right person. Right, it'll put you in the right spot. So I can assume right now that pink noses is probably the last subgroup, while glasses are the last group. Mm -hmm. So you would probably go here. And I know Cyclopses are next. Since there are no more ones with glasses, I can start working with Cyclopses now. And I know that Revs are the first subgroup. Pink is the last subgroup. Yeah, so you would probably go here. Now the question is, what's the next, the what's the next subgroup? And that's where I have to guess and check again. So let's put you. Oh wait, yeah, you here. Okay, so blue. It looks like blue. So if there's any more blue noses, Cyclops. Yeah, Cyclops with blue noses. Then no, don't help me. <laughs> well, I mean, I was pointing. At it. You would have seen it eventually. Um. So now that now I know it's blue, so there's no more Cyclops with blue noses. There's only one more Cyclops with a red nose, so he has to go here. Now comes the thing where I don't know what the third group is. So it can either be the gla the funky glasses one or the beady eye. Well, no, it's not beady. It's like dot eyes. So let's just see. Okay. So you have to go here then. And now we know that the next group I have to do has to be the shady eyes. The, the shady, not the shady eyes, but the, no, the shady eyes. laid back eyes, I guess. And I know for the fact shady. that the pink is the last subgroup, so you have to go here. And let's see. The only ones left are green, so. It wouldn't matter either way, would it? Oh. Right. Oh, sorry. My bad. Wrong eyes. Wrong eyes. Okay. Because I kept saying shady. It's yeah. Throwing you off. So you have to go here. You have to go here. And you go here. You've done quite well. And there we go. All right then. Now it's Austin's turn. 
All right. I feel like I represent the everyman here. The common man that doesn't do well with puzzles. <laughs> but I can figure him out with enough time. All right. So we know red is first. And yellow is second to last. And Cyclops second to last. Shades second. So... Hey, what about you? Well, why don't we see if you want there? Okay. Well, I still think glasses is the last group then. And we know that blue knows he has a pink and he has a yellow. So either pink is the last or yellow is the last. Okay, so pink is the last subgroup. And then, what was that, yellow? Yeah. Yeah, and we know yellow is second to last. That's right. Okay. So, next is Cyclops. So, there's only one Cyclops I can see. So he'd have to go over here. Sweet. Okay. The next, yeah. Next group. Uh, okay, so it's either beady eyes or shady eyes. I'll try beady eyes. Well, it would be, the last subgroup is pink. So yeah, it would be either him or her. But it wouldn't matter, right? Because we're only going yeah, off of eyes. And yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Because uh, hair, for this puzzle, hairs and feet do not play any meaning in this puzzle. Okay, and then these all have the same eyes and nose too, so it doesn't matter with them either. Okay, so we know shades is next. And then, so we gotta find pink nose, there he goes. And then we know yellow's next, so it'd be him. And then, let's see, we have green next. So, no green, and these all have blue nose, so it doesn't matter. So we know these guys are last, and they both have the same eye and nose color. Good job! Man. See? I hit even faster than you, which means I get bonus points, which means I win everything. No. Yep, that's exactly That's not... It no, it... No. <laughs> it goes by how many... Never mind. Yeah, I, I know you're joking. All right. So... Yeah, you won. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I won. you did perfect on everything. Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> Good job. Thank you. Purple wins. <laughs> Purple's perfect. I'm glad you're not attacking me this time. I couldn't. You're too perfect. No, don't say that. It was perfect. <laughs> no, I'm not. You're perfect right here. No. You were. I mean, yeah, but I don't. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to gloat about this because I know it's gonna come back and bite me in the ass. I'm not gonna gloat. Uh, that was fun coming back to it. It's like there's a bunch of it I didn't remember since I even you know I played it a. A quote unquote a lot in elementary school. Yeah. You're never in the the computer lab for more than like a half hour usually at a yeah. time. So it was like half hour here or there that I'd get on it. And most of the time they usually had something to do in the computer lab. So more like, you know, five minutes here and there I'd play it. But there was still a lot that like brought it back to me. And the more ones that kind of triggered it for me the most was uh the pizza one. Yeah. And the uh the rocks. I don't remember the like the mini games themselves very well, but I remember the the little characters that they had. And I remember uh, whenever you make your Zumbinis, you're on like a co like a yeah. cliffside. Yeah. Don't they like sail away well, from their like land Well, it's like the something? bottom part of a cliffside. Okay. By like a beach and a beach. So is it like they have like landed there or they're getting ready to set sail? They're about somewhere? to set sail. Yeah, because they jump onto the boat at the end or something. Yeah, I remember. Oh, there's their boat down there yeah. right there. This is their old island they used to live on, which before it got invaded by, I forgot who, but... Someone invaded them, or they scammed them and took away their island, so now they're trying to get to Zumbiniville, a new place where they can live. It's convenient. It's already named Zumbiniville. I know, right? <laughs> Why were they not there before? <laughs> <laughs> Man, should we live in this place called... That's named after us? Nah. Let's live on this should island. We, should we live on this island called Human Island? Nah. <laughs> let's, let's live on Bird Island. That was fun to go back to. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. Like I said before, I... I love this game because the, the puzzles are... They're pretty... That's a, We've said this before, but it, even back then, even with kids' games, it's like they expect more... Yeah. They like put more effort into it than kids' games these days. Yeah, and like I said before, we were playing it on hard. Because this... Not so easy is easy. Oh, so hard is medium. Very hard is hard. And very, very hard is very hard. <laughs> so No, it's very, very hard. <laughs> so I thought very hard would be enough to where it's like... It would be a good difficulty level for us. But I mean... It's like, I remember playing this when I was younger on Not So Easy, and by then it was hard, but now that I'm, I'm older, Not So Easy is 
It, it, yeah. It, it really is really easy. Not so easy, I feel like it's probably more just common sense and being able to recognize some sort of pattern. Yeah, pretty which much. Which is what you kind of want kids to do to begin right. with, is just recognize patterns. And as you play... Because how this game works is as you play through it, as you get more Zumbinis through to Zumbiniville, it ups the difficulty when you're playing the journey. Mm, I see. So. I see. Oh, is is there like an armored... Like a... That's a, that? that's, that's a frog. That's a frog? Yeah. He doesn't look like no frog. Who are you to like, judge? He looks like a possum. Who are you to judge? Look, this whole game's about judgment. <laughs> Judging the <laughs> You're zoomies. right, you're right. It actually is. This game's putting some bad signals here. So yeah, if you're looking for a fun little puzzle game to, you know, I think it's kind of relaxing. It's not really... Yeah, yeah. The... I mean, it gets stressful whenever... Because I, I didn't want Austin and I to play all of these because... Um, some of them you can't lose at. Some of them it gives you infinite chances mm -hmm. to uh, get through it. And yeah. so, but, I mean, even the ones where you do have to worry about stuff, there's no big downside to losing a Zubini because they don't die. Like I said, they just go back to a checkpoint. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, and, it's a very relaxing and calming puzzle game. And one of the downsides is that, you know, it doesn't have music, but I think that could also be kind of upside because then you can just play some of your own music while yeah. you're playing. You know, just chill, play some Play some Symphony of the Night music. That then it might take away the relaxing. And you're like, na, 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 and you're like, oh god, Zumbini's getting trying eaten by Dracula. <laughs> 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 okay, doke. Thanks for joining us, guys. Happy June. Bye, everybody. See ya. <laughs> <laughs>